Hello everybody, we are in this section 3 and the E-Tabs and Safe Course. Now in this section we will determine the section of the Waffle Slab Type 2 and the Story 2. The difference between Story 1 and Story 2 um, between Waffle Slab Type 2 and Type 1 is the, the types we told before the Waffle Slab Type 1, the spacing between the ribs is between 1 meter and, t and 2 meter. But and this waffle slab type 2, the spacing between ribs is between 0 and 1 meter. We take the spacing between the ribs equal to 80 centimeter and the two direction x and y. We return to the presentation. Uh, the waffle slab type 1, the, the, this uh, type of slab is two-way slab. We use waffle slab when we have long span and high life load. Spacing between ribs below one meter. Loads, as, as we have said before, the dead load equal to 3.5 kN per meter square. Uh, this load is always for waffle slab and the modeling and ETAPs. Uh, for life load equal 5 kilo newton per meter square because this plan this story is a parking story the table uh, differ uh, for type 1 uh, we have uh, as the t uh, the table of ty uh, waffle slab type 1 but this uh, this number here change and differ so the hs lab uh, we choose this panel because this panel as the story one uh, us the maximum uh, get us the maximum thickness so the edge of slab equals 710 plus 548 times 0 0.5 over 2 over 24 why over 24 because it is an exterior panel without drop so the edge of slab equal to 27 centimeter we need to use hidden beam so edge of slab equal edge of beams how we calculate edge of beams the same table for beams use it and story one we use it edge of beam equal the one the one same beams the one the maximum this beams the one and continuous beam as story one give us the maximum thickness so uh, the edge of beam equals 695 over 18.5 equals 38 centimeter compared with edge of slab we choose edge of slab equal edge of beam equals 38 centimeter s1 and s2 equal 0.8 meter because type 2 tf is the topping equal the topping of the, this uh, of the slab the waffle slab as the, the story one type one equal eight centimeter always and this is a constant uh, constant parameter like the like the ribs the width of ribs equal to uh, eight uh, twenty centimeter the section of the anterior beams we choose it as the as and story one b uh, 100 by the width ones with widths uh, 100 centimeter by 38 centimeter the section of the exterior beam uh, here and story 2 we have exterior beam and story 1 we don't have exterior beam because it is a basement so we have a retaining wall but in story 1 we have exterior beam with we, we want to put a, a drop beams uh, uh, around the the plan so we choose to use drop beam the thickness of drop beams uh, we, we take it two times edge of slab so uh, edge of slab equals 38 centimeter two times 38 equal 75 centimeter the width we take the width and uh, of uh, of the of this these beams equal 25 centimeter so uh, which uh, the, the anterior beam is with section b 100 by 380 centimeter and the exterior beam are drop beams with section equal to 25 by 75 centimeter uh, this section are a, a pre-dimension section we are we are, we modeling it into the etaps and then we check them uh, uh, if are sufficient sufficient or not thank you for listening we will continue on the next section